Hey guys, Ioki here. Today's video is brought to you by Try Harder. Try Harder is an artificial intelligence coach designed to help you climb in League of Legends. Looking at data from all games of solo queue worldwide, Try Harder compares you to every other player on the same role in Champion. Every game, Try Harder analyzes 1400 metrics to pinpoint areas for improvement and offer up actionable advice based on your playstyle, learned from thousands of top players and coaches. Some coaches will charge you $200 for a single hour of coaching, but you'll get Try Harder coaching 24-7 for the low price of $9.99 per month. Even better, use my discount code TRYHARDERIOKI for 10% off. So don't be hard stuck. Learn how to play like the greatest support alive at tryharder.gg. I'll leave a link to them down in the description, guys. Try harder, be better. Wait, wait, right here, right here. Nice! Alright, we got a slash, we got a slash. Alright, boys, we are playing set support. This is it. This is the one you guys have been waiting for, asking for. Uh, new champion set. We're going to be playing him as a hard engage, kind of bruisery, uh, secondary engage type champion. In the support role, we're against Jin and Thresh. We got a Kalista as our ADC. Uh, we're going to be maxing E because it, uh, ironically, it's a lot like Thresh. It works kind of like his flay. Comes out a little bit faster too. So basically, we're going to be fishing for engages with our E and then uh, all inning after that. Nice thing about Set is that he's got hard engage with his E. If you smash two people into him, it's a nice stun. Even if you don't, it still like works like a vacuum or a flay. And uh, honestly, we played it last game, and if you can land, if you can land the E, you can pretty much all in. Like it's actually pretty crazy. It's actually pretty crazy what you can do. Like starting at level one, guys. So we're going to be all inning with E pretty much every chance we get. It's it, it's it's like a no risk move as well cuz he doesn't have a mana bar. You can also harass people under the turret with W. Uh, we'll see if he walks up. I don't want I definitely don't want to take a a turret shot this early in the game. Walk down here. Is there demolish? I took a turret shot. That's all right. Do some sit-ups in the bush. Five seconds on my E. We're gonna be going in pretty much every time my E's on cool, uh, off cooldown. Easy. Look at the damage, guys. Look at the damage. This champion's not balanced. This champion is not balanced. So we're gonna be chilling. We're basically gonna be doing this uh, up until level six. Level six, uh, we got a couple more options. We can hey, uh, showstopper ADC, showstopper the thresh onto the ADC, all kinds of good stuff. Boom. So, um, for runes, we're going Aftershock, Demolish, Bone Plating, Unflinching, Triumph, Legend, Nasty. So we basically have got like, uh, we're playing like a more aggressive, more damage focused version of Leona. Um, when you play set in the top lane, you want to go conquer since it's a very bruiser heavy lane You're constantly going to be taking little skirmishes things like that with bot lanes It's more basically all in since there's so much more damage down here with two people So I want the survivability of aftershock we're gonna be rushing an item like uh, righteous glory Like I said just go out there you fish for E if you don't miss it. Oh, well Nothing's lost How big is the shield that he gets? Um, it's pretty big. Depending, it, you know, it works off the passive of your W, so it depends how much uh, damage you're taking. All right, again, max and E, guys, max and E. Alright, we got him with the W. Can we get out though? That's the question. I don't think so. I, th I think at least one of us is dying here. I'm going to rotate over here, try to get out. Not bad though, not bad. It was a risky dive. We knew, we knew the risks, guys. Alright, I'm out. I'm out. I'm just going to go back. 
So we are going to be going... We could go Merc Treads this game. I feel like Merc Treads would actually be a really good... Uh, yeah, we're going to go Merc Treads. So we're not going to go Mobies like we normally do on Leona, even though I feel like this is kind of like similar playstyle, because uh, I don't think I'm going to be roaming as much. I think I'm just going to be killing these guys over and over again. Do you think he's broken so far or fairly balanced? I think he's on the strong side. Definitely think he's on the strong side. I love his kit. I think he's really cool. He's really fun. All right, we're going in. Bye bye. Another death. You're not that smart, buddy. We saw the lantern. We saw the lantern. So, um, you want to kind of just like take him by surprise. Pop the Q because it gives you a nice 30% movement speed for 1.5 seconds, which is actually a lot of time for uh, a melee champion to get a speed buff. And just harass him under turret. Try to get a demolish proc off here. Oh, oh boy. Kill the echo, kill the echo. There we go, there we go. Okay, okay. Not bad, boys. Not bad at all. Killing them on their gank. Beautiful. Now we get the demolish proc off. Bye bye. I'm taking turret for her. We out of there, baby. Easy. <laughs> Send him with the question mark. Alright, alright. We're going to do one more. We're going to do one more. Then we're going to go back. This is getting risky. <laughs> this is insane. This is actually nuts. What do we have? Six kills on a Kalista, the worst champion in the game. We have put six kills on her. Oh wait. Okay, I'm out. I'm good. Yeah, I'm really liking the aftershock for uh, survivability here. We're gonna go righteous glory. Grab that. Grab that. And we have flash, and we're about to get our sixes. So, I'm normally not excited about playing with the Callista, but Callista level six is basically gonna let me just like dive them for free with my ulti. And I've got flash. One thing, I'm not gonna show it to you um, right now because I don't wanna bring my flash, but you can, uh, you can flash E, you can E flash, sorry. So I can start this animation and then flash onto them. Nope, you can't. Oh, I'm sorry. I just misinformed you. I misinformed myself. You cannot E-flash. That's W that you can do that with. My fault, my fault, guys. You can't E-flash. All it does is make you look really, really, uh, goofy. I remember we got, uh, Callista ulti if we need it, but we don't need it here. Nice, nice, nice. Boom. So your basic combo, uh, when you're taking turrets and stuff, you won't be using it on, on, on uh, champions too much because you're engaging with your E, but it's, uh, you want to hit it left, right, and then Q, Q. Oh. If you have time to, you can definitely use it uh, on champions, but in the bot lane, there's usually like a lot of ways for them to get you off you. It's not like the top lane where you're just like constantly fighting in melee range like this. Yes, it is, Absol. Yeah, sorry, I, I messed up about the, uh, the E flash. You can start here and then flash halfway through and it'll actually move the hitbox. It's not E. I was trying, I was trying both of them out in custom tool the other day, that's why I thought that. Alright, we've got, uh, we've got Infernal Drake been taken. Uh-oh. This guy's gonna ult, right? Nope, he's just getting executed. Bummer. Alright, let's take... Let's take this turret. Probably just, uh, go mid now, right? Your bot lane is just completely deflated. This 
shoved in, start taking turrets. Oh, hello. Later, dude. Support, by the way. Oh. We're good. We're not we shouldn't be taking turret aggro. Oh, we do have turret aggro, okay. Alright, took a took a couple too many turrets there. Alright, I'm out. Uh, we need 200 gold for Righteous Glory. Could probably go gank top lane now. Yeah, I'm not waiting 90 gold for that. Do some setups while we're waiting. Is the bottom bar your build up for W? Yes, it is. That's your that's your grit. All right, coming in for the gank, boys. We're coming in. Easy. Easy, shove this up. All right, 15 seconds on our ulti again. I do have Righteous Glory. I'm actually gonna go back for that. I want my Righteous Glory. Are you building full tank? Yeah, yeah. I think uh, he, he's a bruiser even when you play him top. I think the best way to do it is to uh, just go tank items. Like Righteous Glory could be good. Locket could be good. Um, Black Cleaver. You know, e even uh, even even Titanic Hydra, Dead Man's. I really, really like uh, Righteous Glory as an item though. Like, definitely my favorite item in the game. All right, 20 seconds on my flash. So we're gonna pop our Q, and then we're gonna pop our uh, Righteous, and we're just gonna run at him. Should be good. CC him so he can't ulti. Oh! Easy, baby! Let's go! Dude, this... Okay, this combo's actually kind of nuts. Welcome to Set's Bounce House, boys. Alright, let's go back to top now. Let's go give Riven some more loving. He does seem really fun. Yeah, his champion's pretty nuts. We have him. Oh, we have him. Good stuff. Good stuff. He's going to ulti out of this. We can probably still get him. Oh, man. Echo is so hard to chase. Echo is like actually so hard to chase. He's kites around with his Q and his dash. Oh, we got him though. We got him. Do we have him? Nope. Oh, clean, dude. Clean, clean, clean. Oh, someone's gotta go. Someone's gotta go mid. Ah. Oh, <laughs> the saving, the saving, uh, golden mode shield in hell. I was gonna die to, uh, I was gonna die to turret. All right. Question is, can we save the Sedwani? <laughs> Wait, I think I'm actually gonna get out. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Alright, now we go. 
Alright, that's gonna be the FF boys. Let's take a look at the damage charts. This has been set support. Let me know what you guys think about the building strat down in the comments. Let's take a look at the, uh, let's see how much damage we did. Callista obviously is going to have done the most damage, but I, I, I really like that. I think it worked out really well. So let's go. Let's honor Callista. Alright, so we did third most on our team. Callista did more. We did more than everybody else on their entire team playing set support, guys. So, uh, yeah, I think he could be like a nice little pocket pick. Something he, he's like a, he's like a bruisery, more damage oriented Leona. But uh, let me know what you guys think about set support down in the comments. Take it easy, guys. Peace.